you know, no matter how angry you are at yourself for your injury or hardships in life, your challenges, what you're going through, what you're trying to get over, what you're trying to excel at, no matter how angry you are at yourself, don't ever take it out on building new relationships and friendships because I'm learning that as I'm getting older and I'm recovering and I wanna do more of the world and see more of the world and explore and travel and do all these things, I see how radically important it is to have friends. You know, our generation, we are all so introverted to a certain degree. We're easy on our phones all the time. We don't need anybody with us to confide in. We can just confide within ourselves with, <laughs> with AI and social media and text messaging. And we don't go to coffee shops and hang out with friends and talk to them like an episode of Friends. You know, but I'm, as I'm getting older, I, when I was recovering, I thought to myself that I want to be independent, so independent that I want to do everything by myself. I didn't want doctors. I didn't want surgeons. I didn't want rehab clinics. I didn't want people, my family. I didn't want any of them with me, even friends. I wanted to be and do things by myself. I wanted to show myself, fulfill myself, that I was able to travel, see the world, shop, explore, travel, taxi, says travel twice, you know, but because I love traveling, that's what I love to do. But I find out that having friends is only brings you to a new level of independence because when you have people around you, it's not just you no more. You can spend more time with having the right people by your side.